What's going on YouTube? This is Ultima High Device Vids, and today we're going to be taking a look at a new Cydia tweak called Epicenter. This is available on Cydia for $1, and what this tweak is, it's a passcode unlock screen replacement. So when I slide to unlock, as you can see, I get a brand new interface. I get that nice animation when I slide to unlock, as you can see right there, and it's this nice circle view as opposed to the grid one. And of course, you could just tap on your numbers just like this, as you can see, to input them. If you get it wrong, it'll, you'll have that little red animation. And if you get it right, it's going to be a green animation just like that. You could also drag and drop these numbers on the little unlock button in the middle. So as you can see, I could just drag, as you can see, a number like this. As you can see, it's free-floating, and I could just drag it right on there. And as you can see, I could do this with all of my numbers. And you notice, you know, whenever I input numbers, as you can see, the little unlock button does get bigger, and eventually it turns red or green. Very good looking tweak. And if you go into settings on your device and open up the preferences for this tweak, of course you have the ability to enable or disable the tweak. You do need to respin for this option to take an effect. And you have a few other options as well. We have scramble number positions, which does exactly as the name suggests. It's just gonna scramble the position of the numbers. As you can see right here, it's not, you know, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, etc. It's all scrambled and you have to find the numbers just like this. My passcode's one, two, three, four, so I have to find those numbers, as you can see, then it's gonna unlock the device. Then we have the use button and location and this applies to scramble number position so if you have scramble number positions on if you use use button location basically it's good it's still going to scramble the position of the numbers however it's basically not going to matter which number you're tapping it's going to matter what position you're tapping so because my passcode is one two three four uh, originally you know the one two three and four buttons would be here one two three and four so if I tap this with um, use button location on, as you can see, that's going to work because it's only paying attention to the position. It's not paying attention to the actual number that's showing up there. I know that's a little bit confusing, but it's definitely a security feature, so it makes things a little more complicated if someone's trying to snoop around in your device. There's also a video explanation of that right there. And if we scroll down, we have two sliders to configure button size and corner radius. I'm just going to make the button size bigger, and for the corner radius, the further the slider is to the right, the more circular the buttons are going to be, and if you go to the left, it's going to start to reminisce a square. So I'm just going to go to the lock screen here and show you that the changes did take an effect. As you can see right there, they're you know more square-like, and they're larger. I'm just going to go ahead and enter the passcode just like this, and there you go. And down below at the bottom here, we could visit the developer and designer's Twitter pages. And with that being said, that's pretty much all for this tweak. I really do like it. Personally, I'm going to go ahead and keep the scramble number positions and button location off. I just want to have a standard passcode, but that's entirely up to you, of course, if you want to be super secure. And it's really good looking. I really do like this tweak. Very well designed. Just good functioning tweak overall. Once again, it's available in City for $1. And that's all for this video. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys later.